Hello everyone and welcome to another Bee Swarm Simulator video. Now in this video I'll be going over all the codes that are in the game currently um, and then after that I'll be going over just through my normal playthrough I'll be doing some in my normal playthrough stuff. Um, so yeah let's get right into it. So to get to the codes you want to click the settings button and then it, it says enter code here and you want to enter the codes I'm about to tell you. I also move my face cam again just letting you know um, because it's gonna block the things. So yeah uh, the first one here is Mystical Madness. So you're gonna click Submit here, and boom, you get a Mystical Royal Jelly, which is really good, because that's like a free uh, free Mythic Bee, which is amazing. So yeah, that's the first code. Okay, so the next code here is Ange, I think that's how you pronounce it. I already um, claimed it, but it gives you 10 oranges, which is very good. The next code here is Buzzy Bakery, which gives you a bunch of cool ice treats. I don't even know what they do, but one white ice treat, one red, and one blue. And the next code is Oink, and from that we get one Royal Jelly, which is just a nice little Royal Jelly. Next one is Brick. I'm not sure if you need to capitalize this one, but yeah, you get a little bit of honey. It's not that good. Okay, so the next code here is Volcanic J is Big Smelly. Uh, yeah, and then we get uh, 5,000 honey from that one. The next code here is 538213, and we get uh, one Infused Royal Jelly, which I actually don't know what it does, but I think it's pretty good. The next one here is Converter Code, which, there you go, uh, gets one Royal Jelly, one Pocket Converter, which I think is like a Micro Converter in Beast Swarm, uh, and I didn't see the other thing, I was thinking it was Honey, uh, yeah, it's just Honey. Okay, so the next code here is Thanks, or Thanks Sausages, uh, I don't know how to pronounce it exactly, but it is, I think it's from, uh, Thanks to his YouTube channel, uh, but yeah, this is how you spell it, T-H-N-X and sausages. And it gives you 3T, which is good, and then one row jelly, and 2,500 honey. Next one is Takes the Nectar here, which gives one white fungus stew. I don't know what that is, but yeah. Uh, and the next code here is Hoops the Code, which I think is another reference to a YouTuber called Hoops the Bee. Um, so we get that, and we get one row jelly, one infused row jelly, and 2,500 honey. The next one here is super green tea, and you get three green tea from it, which is uh, pretty expected, but... The next one here is cool update, very cool, and it is three white fungus stew, one green tea, and one tea, which is another very good code. And the last code I have to show is rest in peace, which gives one potato. I'm not exactly sure what this is a reference to. It might be Technoblade passing away, I'm not exactly sure, but... Uh, yeah, those are all the codes. Okay, so now we're gonna get on to things I normally do in these beekeeper videos. And the first one is, I got this mythic bee off camera. It was annoying, I just randomly got it. I was just using some royal jellies and stuff, and I got lucky and I got this lunar bee. Definitely makes up for the unlucky I got last time, which I got a bunch of basic bees. I've transformed most of them into other things, but, uh, yeah. I got this cool lunar bee, which is amazing. Um, and we also, I also got a decent amount of beeswax, so we're just going to use all those, uh, there we go, okay. <laughs> um, and yeah, so we, I don't, oh yeah, I'm going to have to get some eggs, I think. Oh no, I forgot exactly how to do this. Um, do you just use a royal jelly? I think, yeah, you can just use a royal jelly. Um, let's use an infused royal jelly. We're going to see what that gives us. Um, so yeah, I'll be back when this is done. Oh, I just realized I was dumb and I... Spread it with a buzzy bee, which is not what I want to do. I should have done the, the mystical bee or something. But yeah, we're going to see what we get. I don't know what an infused one does, but let's see. We got... Ooh, a water bee! Legendary! I really don't know what the infused thing does, but... We got a water bee, which is really cool. It's icy and magnificent, and it's a legendary too, so... Definitely going to keep that. Uh, and now, should we use some toothpaste? I think we should use some toothpaste. We got to see what it does. Um, I'm probably not using correctly, but I'm going to use it on the Lunar Bee, and let's see what we get. Ooh, two minutes, wow. Okay, so I think I'm going to speed it up here, and can I use a potato? Oh, yep, a tribute to the best pig. Yeah, that's got to be from Technoblade. Rest in peace, Technoblade. Let's see, can I, okay, I can't drag it to the tree. Let's see, what could I drag? Okay, let's see. Um, I think it's this one, but I don't, it's, it's not five minutes, so I don't really want to speed it up. Maybe this? No, that's a pocket converter. Uh, I think I'll just wait it out. Okay, so it's just finishing up, and I got a sweet bee. I already have that, but it is a red bee, which is good, um, and suspicious and friendly. I think all sweet bees are like that. But yeah, I think we're going to do it. We're going to use the mystical royal jelly, and since I'm a red hive, I'm going to breed it. Let's see how long it's going to take. Probably a while. 
Three minutes, okay, that's actually not too bad. But we're gonna feed it a red tree thing. So now it is guaranteed to be a red mythical, which is gonna be really good. Um, and I, you know, I think, uh, you guys are probably gonna get mad at me for this, but I'm just gonna speed it up with this thing. Uh, even though it's not gonna use the full time, but yeah, let's just speed it up, and boom, a magma bee! Oh, wow! This bee is actual burning magma, righteous and threatening. That thing looks cool. I don't know what it does. I think we can click on it, let's see. Magma blast, oh, and then a red nectar boost. What does our water bee do? Uh, splash, okay, oh, it regenerates flowers, that's nice. And then this one is night light, and this one's night boost, and then it also gives night boost some more, more nectar and convert speed and stuff during nighttime. So yeah, I'm gonna go try out these bees quick and see what they can do. Yeah, here are a bunch of tokens. I can't even see what's going on, but let's see. Uh, whoa, what's going on? Uh, my game's lagging a lot. Whoa, there's a little lighthouse thing, and I also got a moon boost. I got a uh, night light. Oh, um. And, okay, so more bonuses at night, and good thing it just became nighttime, so that's perfect. Uh, and then I also got a bunch of red boosts. So yeah, I'm gonna keep waiting for more power-ups. Ooh, we got our water wand, let's see what it does. Uh, yeah, just okay, it wasn't it wasn't that exciting, it just kind of regrew everything in the area, which is kind of cool. Ooh, here we go, here's the magma ability, unfortunately it's on the side, but let's see what happens. Whoa! Oh, that's actually really good. Wow. Um, wow, that was actually really good. It got, like, all these flowers. Would have been better if it was in the middle, but that's good. I also realized, um, I'm getting some automatically converted honey. I don't know what that's from, but it's from something. Um, but yeah, that's, that's pretty cool. Um, so we're gonna go up to the 10B zone. Uh, I was gonna, I ran out of time last episode to show it, but yeah, we're gonna show the new t things in the 10B zone. I don't really know what's up here, but yeah, we're gonna see. So I think I'm gonna talk to the Baker Butterfly first. Uh, why hello there, I've heard about you, you're the new beekeeper. I just wanna see, I have loads of recipes for foods. Okay, so he gives the recipes, I'll give you baker tokens. Okay, so, they aren't the easiest quests, we'll have to see what they are. Uh, this one, ah, uh, that's actually not too hard. Uh, I'm gonna go get that done right now. Oh, wait, let's see, this is probably gonna give me so much. Oh my gosh, that filled it up immediately! That was insane, oh my gosh. It looks like we completed the quest, uh, so let's go turn it into, uh, what is it, uh, like the baker butterfly, I think, yeah. Okay, so let's turn it in, great job, uh, I'll make stuff, uh, uh, white ice treat, I uh, got, yeah. and five baker tokens, okay, cool. Uh, we'll just get the next, uh, white ice treat, I think it said, but yeah, let's go and see what we can get, I don't know. So, okay, he also gives you recipes, but I don't have any recipes yet. So these are all very expensive. Infused jelly, which is I think just good. And then I can buy that, and then I can also buy a white thing. I can also just buy baker tokens, okay. Should I should I buy some? I, I have a lot of honey, I'll, I'll buy, okay, they do get it more expensive. I, I should have assumed that. Um, I could buy, should I buy, I, I'm gonna buy, wait, what does this do? Um, I'm gonna buy a white ice tree, cause it's gonna speed up my, uh, my what is it, breeding time. So that, that will be pretty handy, that's nice. Okay, cool. Um, so yeah, I'm on a bit of a time constraint today, so I will not be able to record too much more. But yeah, I think we did a lot of interesting stuff in this video. I covered all the codes, and I also tried out the bakery a little bit. So yeah, and I showed off my new Mythic piece as well. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!